a university continuing to court controversy. The latest debacle, Ilof's 10 million rand donation to a consultancy company in which he had a stake. The investigation shows, amongst others, that PFMA provisions were not followed and that the donation was not approved by the University Council. The report is complete at the moment. Uh, we are just taking it to Council for further processing. But however, we have also given permission now to the uh, Hawks, as they call them, the commission, the, it's, a, it's a commercial crime unit of SAP that is now dealing with the case at the moment. A group representing students and alumni says there is enough evidence to charge Ilof with fraud and corruption. We think there is enough prima facie case to uh, arrest Dr. Ilof with a view to further engage and uh, let him go and account in court. We are calling for the immediate release of that particular uh, investigation report because we are saying that uh, those that are alleged in that particular uh, uh, issue of 10 million, they must be taken forward and they must be able to take responsibility. In a statement sent to the University Council, Ilof says that the donation was above board and that you'll go to court to defend it. Selotatai, SABC News, Mahikeng.